Act like we never left BDA and today I'm bringing you a review of fairy tale. Never mind. You know what it is is in the title. This chapter of fairy tale. I've missed a few chapters and you know this is how it is with fairy tale. Sometimes hype chapters. I just you know, let's just get right into it. In this chapter, we have Jacob, and basically he said that August, he knows how to manipulate what they were trying to use to locate them. So he strolls into the guild. I was surprised. I wasn't sure who it was. I expected it to be one of the Spriggans, but not one of those guys, because they were supposedly tracking them. But then he explained what August did, and he's saying it's elderly day, pretty much, and he's come to kind of take out the trash before August gets there. He uses a hype magic, space magic, which I thought was really cool. I, I was digging the space magic. So he used that, wipes out the whole guild. Makarov, you know, everybody gets wiped out. And, you know, he's about to, he actually, he locates Mavis, and I'm not sure if this is uh, because of the space magic or, or what it was. He locates Mavis, and he's actually beating Mavis or hurting her, even though she's not physically there. So, you know, space manipulation, I think that has something to do with it. So he was doing that, and basically he's telling her that he's going to kill everybody, and that at this point, all you need to do is tell me where the fairy heart is, and I can bring your friends back because they're about to die, and if you don't, they're going to die. And Mavis is contemplating, she's thinking, I'm like, how could they get pushed in the corner, into a corner, like this quickly by one guy, but they don't know his magic, they don't know what he can do, so of course they're going to get overwhelmed. Well, but he's about to um, wipe Mavis out for the most part. Then Lucy comes out of nowhere. And Lucy, when I saw Lucy, I was like, okay, more than likely that goddamn clock saved her. And uh, lo and behold, the clock, whatever, I don't remember his name, but he came out and in his... When she's in him, you know, things like that that doesn't uh, really affect him. So she, her, Natsu, and Happy, there were the three that were inside of this inside of the clock so therefore they were okay they were unaffected right so lucy she attacks jacob lesio and jacob says you know what mavis on second thought i'm going to basically rip this girl head rip this girl's head from her body and she's gonna be unrecognizable jacob attacks lucy at this point and i'm thinking lucy has no chance she's about to die she doesn't know where she can beat a spriggan. But then I felt like there was something built in where, okay, with Natsu being with her, he should come back. He's definitely going to be, he's definitely going to wake up. And lo and behold, Natsu comes in, basically stops the, the, the knife or whatever. And he's basically about to burn Jacob, Jacob to ashes. I mean, it's kind of expected. I mean, he was there for a reason. I mean, but I think it's cool how they went about it. Now, I don't know if Natsu can beat Jacob. I expect him to come back with, like, a, probably a power-up or something. He was like, oh, this has been affecting my whole time, draining my energy. So I expect be, he's going to probably be more powerful now. So I expect him to go in. Um, Jacob seems cool as hell. The first thing, he's an assassin, right? And he's an assassin, and he basically told them, even though the whole guild is here and I'm an assassin, I felt no need to be an assassin with you guys because you guys ain't shit. So he just walked in there, walked in there, and the space magic, space magic, that could be really dope. I, I, I really can't wait to see what's going to happen next chapter. I know I missed a few chapters. I apologize for that. I'm going to try and get back into the swing of things with this. And I did. Natsu versus Jacob, I don't know. I don't know. He should be able to beat him because I expect another power. I expect something because of the tumor. It's now it's now down. I expect him to say that's the reason. That was sucking a lot of my energy. I feel a lot stronger than before. So that's pretty much it. I mean, let me know what you thought about this chapter. Do you think Nazi can beat Jacob? Maybe with some of Lucy's help? Because he annihilated the whole guild, essentially by himself. So let me know what you thought. Like the video if you did, subscribe to the channel if you have not. That'll be dope. Have a good day, people.